Hey guys, it's time for a brew. Today's brew is a just basically a standard black tea, um, but it actually is pretty darn good. And here it is. Yeah, black pearl. No, this isn't pirate tea. Uh, it might as well be because it is awesome. Ugh. It's actually, um, some, like, you call it quality black tea, which everybody just calls their stuff qual quality, obviously. And But it's pure long leaf, and it, it really is some pretty big um, leaves in there. Uh, it's really cool. I like these. Um, mainly for the fact, like, I don't know if you can see this, but like, there's some really long leaves in there. Um, so I, it really does taste pretty darn good. Um, and also, I love these little plastic-ish. Uh, I guess it's plastic. I assume it's plastic. Uh, like netting, and it's really cool. I mean, I can tell where the price comes from for these. Uh, that they've just done so much to it with this plastic, and then this nice, like almost like nylon-ish string that comes on it uh, and then the branding is also on the netting uh, like different crossways than the rest of it so that way it looks all fancy fancy and that is exactly what it is it is fancy that's what they should call it fancy tea instead of quality but it is quality though don't get me wrong tastes amazing Oh, it's so good. So, I haven't made a video in a couple days. Uh, Friday was a standard day. Had work and got a lot of stuff done, so I was really happy. I love when I get caught up at the end of the week. It's just so rewarding to know that everything is, for the most part, done. And then when I come in on Monday, it's kind of a fresh start. So great. Love the feeling. Clean bench, clean work area. Oh, just clean yourself out, clean your mind out, all that. Oh, this tea is so good, I have no idea. Anyways, <laughs> um, so like Friday night, uh, went out to eat with the parents, and had a okay meal, had some wings, good stuff, always good. Uh, and then I came home and found Martha Vader streaming on Twitch. Uh, she did a 24-hour stream uh, over last night into today uh, for Child's Play. That's it, Child's Play. She was trying to earn $1,000, and it was going all right. She tried to play Amnesia, wimped out a bunch, she kept pausing the game, then she went and played StarCraft for a while, and she went back and tried to play, and then that didn't work either. Um, but good, the good news, even though she chickened out on Amnesia... Uh, I would too, probably. I don't know. I've, I haven't played. I've seen a couple playthroughs of it. But anyways, uh, I think she earned almost two thousand dollars. I didn't get to see the very end of the stream. Uh, I was just I was doing stuff around here, and I, I think she earned almost two thousand dollars. It's like, yeah, yeah that's, that's just awesome. I, I I love that we can interact with each other and get stuff like that to happen. I mean, we can really get a lot of money saved up and uh, for different charities. It's always cool. I, I, I love to see that. just love to see that. That's really cool. Uh, today, though, did all right. I didn't get up as early as I want, but, you know, when you stay up late, that's what happens. I was up to, like, oh, goodness, like 1, 2 o'clock watching Martha's stream. Uh, it was kind of my own way of supporting since I just can't afford to give to something like that. Uh, but got up today and had breakfast and had coffee and just kind of chilled out. Uh, the weather over last night into today was just fantastic. Uh, I had the windows open all night and I had the windows open pretty much all day today. Still have most of mine open. Uh, every once in a while you might see... Yeah, there we go. I got my finger in the frame. You might see this move a lot. So there's no ghost. It's just the wind. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's pretty much just relaxed today. I really didn't do a whole lot. But I figured I need to do something productive. So I uh, did some, like, end of the month finances, checking bills and such. All that 
boring adult stuff. Boo hoo. Uh, so I was like, all right. I let the gas tank get a little lower than I normally do. The light never comes on, but I kind of let it go this time. And so I went to get gas in the car. I had to get that done. Uh, also to enjoy the weather and have the windows down and have some nice music playing. And, all right, look, I want to talk to you guys about something that really kind of bugs me. This, if this goes, if this video goes long, I don't care. This bugs the crap out of me. All right, I go go to a gas station, and someone has their door open and sitting inside when you get there, and you don't really realize. You know, you don't see everything. You're kind of worried, getting parked and make sure you're, you know, you got enough room for the between the gas tank and the pump and all that stuff, and and then you realize that they're pumping gas because you get out and you do your stuff and then you just, and you hear theirs go off and they get out of the vehicle and go pump. Urgh, it aggravates me to no end. Okay, look people, it does not take that long to fill up a tank unless you're putting it on the slowest drip possible or something, I don't know. How lazy are you that you cannot stand next to your vehicle and pump the gas? Not to mention the safety hazards of getting back in your vehicle and then getting back out and touching the gas pump. I know most of them are rubber coated in some way, so you're not going to have a shock and the odds of an actual spark and fumes and boom, it's not going to happen. But it's the principle of the matter. You don't use your phone, you don't get back in your vehicle. You just don't do it. I wait to use my phone. I use my phone after I've done everything. I've gotten everything put back away. I got my cap sealed. Everything. Um, I record uh, my gas mileage uh, and I'm like how far I've gone on it, just so I can see what sort of miles per gallon I'm getting around the time. To kind of, it, it's kind of a precaution if I see it really going down, um, like this last time. But I had some work done, so. I think the mechanic had it on for a while, and so I kind of it kind of ran down my tank a little bit. So hopefully this next time will be better. But anyways, but it, it's just something I do. But I do it afterwards, after everything is done. I don't touch my phone or anything while I'm do, while I'm at the pump. But today had seen some lady get in, get back in her vehicle and sit there, and then it snapped like it stopped. It must have hit, you know, it must have filled up. Like, mine used to do that. It used to fill up, like, really quickly, and then it would, like, shut the pump off, but I knew it wasn't done by how many gallons and, you know, all that. So I'd start it up again. I'm like, oh, okay, it started up again. You need to pull the nozzle out just a little bit just to kind of get it away from that uh, sensor. And hers did that once, and then she got out. She did it. She put it back and kind of got it to where it was going. And she got back in. And not even, I'd say, another 30 seconds, it shut off again. Why? Why? Oh, T, you're so stress relieving. But it's not going to stop my soapbox. Well, it is because my soapbox is kind of over, but I don't understand that. Why, how can you be so lazy? I just, oh, it just, it just aggravates the crap out of me. But, uh, but yeah, so the weather was great. So I really just kind of, oh, lazy people. And then just, ah, oh, this wind. Ah, oh, so good. Uh, it, it's like it was warm today, but it was like that just cool breeze. It's not cold. I even wore shorts. And, you know, and, I, and I'm, I'm very big wuss for cold, guys. I mean, really big wuss for cold. So I wouldn't normally, I won't wear shorts. If you see me in shorts, it's a nice day out. If I got jeans on, it's it's cooler than normal. It's cooler than what I'd like. And if for some reason you find out I have long johns on, it's probably 50 degrees outside, and I can't stand that. Anyways, uh, so Friday night, uh, while watching Marth stream, I also was pl been playing uh, Grand Theft Auto Vice City again. Um, I seen uh, Spam Fish on Twitch playing it a few days ago, and it just like 
oh, just rekindled it. I'm like, oh, I want to play again. All the music and the cars and the horrible graphics in comparison to, like, Grand Theft Auto 4. And I was like, oh, I have to play. I have to play. And it's amazing how much I remember. Like, I remember the map. Like, how to get places and stuff. I mean, it wasn't very big. It wasn't like San Andreas, where it was a humongous... Um, I probably will get Grand Theft Auto V, I assume. I don't know. Money, guys. Money. It's not there. It ain't happening. Um, but yeah, we're getting kind of long in the video. I'm kind of my average spot here. Uh, but one of the final thing to mention, uh, tomorrow I actually am going to a bowling tournament. Uh, me and my little cousin, we actually had gotten, uh, we, we got into a tournament, like an adult youth tournament, whatever. I'm the adult. Yeah. I'm considered an adult, guys. Yeah. It's not just because I do laundry and dishes occasionally. Uh, but we did, I guess we did well enough, uh, and we made it to state level. Yeah. So we doing we doing that tomorrow and if time permits, I will get back to you guys with a vlog, hopefully tomorrow night, and we'll let you know how how that all went. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna take any more of your time, interwebs. I'm sure you got more things to do or more subscriptions to watch, so I will talk to you guys later. Uh, feel free to leave any comments in the in the bottom down there if you like. Uh, remember to thumbs up and subscribe and all that if you're new. And I'll catch you guys next time. See ya.